Oh, well, look at that. Good, good. That was a bit too close, hmm? Is that a Magi bird? Fascinating. I thought they were all extinct. As skilled as I'd read. That was extraordinary. Well done. Who sent you? Was it Kition or Heraclides? They thought I couldn't handle myself out here, but we've shown them, haven't we? Have we? What are you doing out here? Are you joking, Neb? We are searching for the lost vault of the great Sneferu, the founder of the Golden Age of the Old Kingdom. And how are we doing that? Didn't they tell you anything before they sent you after me? Remind me. According to my research, Sneferu hid three artifacts in his pyramids. One in the Medum, his first and failed pyramid. Another in the Bent, whose design he obviously modified after the Medum's collapse. And one in his final masterpiece and tomb, the Shining Pyramid. I have one artifact, but those bandits stole another from me. You'll need to get it back for us. Where was this? The camp in the cliffs to the west of Memphis. You can find them by following the stream. Also, you'll need to find a way into the Shining Pyramid to get the last artifact. I think there's an opening high up, but it's quite the climb. In my youth, I could have done it, but... I will take a look. How many bandits were there? All of them, I think. What makes you think the third artifact is in the Shining Pyramid? Each of the three tombs held one, according to my findings. These pyramids were built by Pharaoh Sneferu during his reign, you see. He took what Imhotep had designed for Pharaoh Josa and improved upon it. Medum was the first, but a design flaw led to a grave collapse. Then came the bent. Its unique shape is due to an alteration that saved it from suffering the same fate as its brother. The Medum and the bent could not keep their secrets from me. Inside each, I found the artifacts indicated in Maneto's Egyptiaca. You've read it, yes? Mm -hmm. So you'll remember the third is said to be contained within the shiny... <laughs>
This plain looking artifact must have some hidden value if it was stored among such treasures. Here are vigilant. Hold your back, don't worry. Where? This must be the artifact the bandit stole from Merkis. Strange thing. Time to find Merkis and see what these three artifacts are up to. Retrieved the other two artifacts. Aha! This confirms my theory. By Ra, that's it! The artifacts form a diagram, but a part is missing. There's no way to connect them. But there's a passage in the Egyptiaca that says the path is clear atop the shining tip, and the inscriptions on this artifact must mean the Pyramidion on top of Sneferu's tomb, the Shining Pyramid. I'm sure the key to the mystery is up there. Why don't you just run up and take a look? What are we looking for at the end of this? The priceless treasures of Sneferu have been lost to the ages. We will be heroes when we recover them and bring them out into the light of day. Hey, I am no grave robber. No, 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 of course not. I promise you, this will not disturb anyone's rest in the field of reeds. Hmm. I will climb up and see what I can find. The priceless treasures of Sneferu have been lost to the ages. We will be heroes when we recover them and bring them out into the light of day. diagram. From here at the Shining Pyramid, it seems to indicate those ruins out east. That's where we will find the vault. What did you see? 
opposite, as I said. Don't keep me in suspense. Did you find anything? Quite the view. The markers fit into place upon the capstone and create a complete diagram. You are remarkable. And does it explain the riddle in the histories about where to find the vault? Mm-hmm. I suspect it meant something to the east of us. I could make out what looks like a ruined temple now. Follow me. I'll get us there. Do not rush into trouble again. With you at my side? Never. How did you cross paths with the bandits earlier? Mm -hmm. Oh, I enlisted their help to find the missing artifacts. What? You mean you hired them? Well, their leader, Belosh, claimed he knew the desert better than anyone. I didn't think they would turn on me. I didn't know they were those kinds of bandits. There are no other kinds of bandits. They all pillage and kill for coin. Yes, they seem rather intent on both, having stolen one artifact from me and then trying to kill me for the other. I, you are a hazard to yourself. I've been told that before. Here we are. The entrance will be hidden, of course. The statues have survived the ages. They look exactly like what was described in the writings of Maneto. Fascinating. But what do they mean? What do you see? The remains of this statue, the Watcher, is supposed to be looking towards the entrance. But where is it now? The ground seems soft here. Let's see what is beneath the sand. By Ra, I wonder what we'll find. One last deadly obstacle. I told you there was nothing to worry about. Come along. This way. Uh, you first. We are the first to set foot here in more than 2,000 years. The treasures that must be here. Nothing to worry about. You did exactly as I would have told you, if you hadn't acted so quickly. A perfectly preserved Pyramidion. A relic of the gods, and the origin of all good things. The first rays of Ra would fall upon it, and light the way for the Benubad who flew over the waters. Oh, oh my. By Ra, all oh, that is divine beauty. Do your eyes see what mine see? This room has been perfectly preserved. Untouched since Sneferu's reign. Is this it? It is mostly filled with old scrolls. Not much gold. Such treasure. Look at all this history. Kition and Heraclides will be in awe. I'll be famous. We'll be famous. Glad I could help. Once I've cataloged what we've discovered, I'll cart it back to the Library of Alexandria so it can be studied and preserved for the ages. Now we can finally remember how Imhotep and Sneferu built the pyramids. Once it is safely in the library, it will be protected from time and the elements. So many lost wonders contained within. How to get all this back to Alexandria?
Strange to see bodies left out like this. The embalmer must know more. It is a shame to see three dead left neglected. What happened? They were just brought here, Magi. A family struck down by the sword. Only the daughter, Ira, survived. She carried them here one by one. Poor girl. All by herself now. A tragic story. Tragic indeed. Where is she now? You can find her on the abandoned date farm near the road where her family died. Ira sounds like a woman worth meeting. Soldiers, they must be looking for Iras. Best lay low, and hope she does too. I should be cautious around here. The soldiers heard that. Hail in peace, Iras. All I want is to speak with you. The last man to say so. Murdered my family. I've come to help you, Iras. How do you come to know my name? A priest told me of you. Ah. My kin have owned this land for centuries. But left it barren until now. A soldier came to us, saying his master held a deed of sale. My father refused to concede the property. Then, well, the rest is as you know it. What will you do? The farm is my birthright. I will work it as long as I can. I can ensure you are not harassed by soldiers. You may try. The villa they spoke of lies northwest of here, on the road to Alexandria. I can do this alone. If you fail, tell the world I died preserving my family's legacy. Find Papyrus. Sophronios. Yet another man may butcher for the sake of wealth.
pitiful end to a pitiful existence. I will tell the others of this, if I see her again. You came back. You will be bothered no longer. You've killed Sophronios? Yes. I wish it had been I who slit his throat. No. You don't. My apologies. Truly, I am grateful for your help. My labor now is to rebuild my farm. But one day, I hope to return to Alexandria. to see the Sarapians so quiet. Great Serapis, are you as merciful as Amun? Welcome, brother. Thank you, priest. It is good to see Egyptians come back. Since my drummer was jailed, it has been quiet. The silence is striking. A tanner jailed my drummer, accused him of stealing a precious Nubian lion skin from the Daivats. Poor soul even worked for him. Tragic. He is an honest man. Leave this in my hands, priest. Medjai, my drummer, is in the Kibodos arsenal nearest the library. Serapis walk with you. And you, priest. Hey, you! Stop! Oh. to draw attention here. Come on the priest's request, drummer. Then get me out of here, Medjai! I cannot help but think. You seem cheerful for a man unable to walk. You jest, Charlie. This is the best day of my life. My foot will cost that Tana. Surely your health is worth more than that. If I can prove nothing, you would be correct. 
That is where you come in, friend. What is it you think I can do? Find the fools who stole it, of course. Return that skin and clear my name. Who stole the lion skin? I turned away from the lion skin for a moment, and a bandit nabbed it, and ran away. I lost him in the crowd. It happened in the Egyptian district. The guards, of course, blamed me. Tough life being an Egyptian in Alexandria. I will find them then. Go on, get that skin. I will be fine. I just need to rest my leg. Then I will go and meet the priest. You clear my name. about that skin. Do you know the Greeks? Easy enough work stealing from him. Skins for days. This is better than fishing. I've yet to get the smell of crocodile out of my nose. Wonder what skin that Tanner will destroy next. His own. His face is leather already. Would only improve it. No color for a lion. not have stolen a thing. Do you wish Serapis displeased with you? No. I am going to sue you for my broken leg, you naked idiot! That is not helping. I knew you Egyptians were all alike. This is what I get for hiring you. Thieves all! I have my best man on this. We will fix it. I am the wronged party here. My skin was stolen. And if you want it back, you will pay him for his suffering, and make amends by kneeling to Serapis. This is your answer, priest? Extortion? Fine. I fear Serapis and I have a long road ahead of us. Blessings on your journey, brother. I wish to serve Serapis further, if you have need. There is one thing. There has been food taken by the guards malignly in the name of Serapis. They take a tithe, then take double for themselves. They bring it to their arsenal and share it with their Philakitai. The people now starve. I worry it will get worse. Do not worry, priest. I will see the people fed. 
I will await among the people at the docks. Serapis, you guards are supposed to uphold the law. <laughs> Pathetic. This food will be put to much better use. This food will serve the people well. One cart of food, priest, as asked for. The Pharaoh's guards were happy to donate it. This seni is more than I expected. The people will be served by Serapis today. May you walk lightly in his steps, priest. And you, Magi. One of Eudorus Philakis? I am no friend of Eudorus. He brought nothing but sorrow to my husband Aristo. The great poet philosopher, jailed. Jailed for writing beautiful things. Words are a powerful weapon. My love spent years writing his masterwork. Years. Then Eudorus plagiarized it and passed my husband's genius off as his own. And Aristo took him to court. Months of arguments. In the end, my husband is beaten, ridiculed, and tossed in a cage. Is this what passes for justice in Alexandria? Oh, my dear man, if you write this wrong, my husband and I can flee this city and be done with this ordeal. If you free him, I know of a boat that will take him on the southern docks. I will wait for you. Please, just bring me back my eyes. Get out of my way! Out of my way! Will no one help me? You, who's this? Another of Eudoro's sycophants come to sneer? Leave me alone with my woes. I am a friend of Phanos, a protector. See that one! She deserves it. Get them! See that one next! Oh, what did he still mean to end the debris? Oh, Harry, he's the abuse. 
Lord. You have more courage than Achilles himself. You've released me from daily beatings. We should go, quickly. The Vlachos broke my hip. Be careful, I pray you. Please, we must get out of this city. We must flee. Those damn guards will find me. Egypt is no place for a philosopher. Beneficent gods! We made it! We you should leave. The Philakitai will surely come after you. I shall flee. My wife has booked us passage to Crete. It was always our plan to go there. Perhaps we will have a better life there. May the gods look over you on your journey. My beliefs on duty and honor are ambivalent. But I can see that you have done yours. If all of Egypt was filled with men of your virtue, life would be divine. Magi, thank the gods. I have not seen one of your kind in many moons. What troubles you, little mother? My son, Tephibi. The boy is mad, always running off. He wishes to be some sort of thinker. Set, take him. He has taken to searching for a cave near the beach. He should have been back by now. If he is lost, I will find him. Thank you, Medjai. This looks to be where she claimed the Phoebe was. His wounds bled out in the water. He must have swum away. Blood leads around the lighthouse. I wonder. The blood trail leads to this door. I must prepare myself. Ah! Phoebe, uh, your mother sent me to find you. Well, that's good. I would have hurt you otherwise. With my mind. <laughs> I doubt it, little man. Okay. Please help me up. Whoa. Feeling a bit... dizzy. I think I lost a lot of blood. Then it is time we get you back to your mother. She will be cross. Ah, fine. Lead on. I have enough strength to leave. Mother sent a warrior to protect me. A philosopher does need a guard. Hey, I'm not your guard. I'm helping your mother. Your badge? The Eye of Horus? It is my Medjai badge. Medjai? Ah, old kingdom. Weren't they killed by the Ptolemies? They forgot one. Would you let me write your story? The last Magi would be a fantastic tale. Well, 
What kind of story would you tell to Phoebe? I know. A fable. Want to put even a soap? There! Get him! He robbed us! You stole from them? Defend my free will, warrior! I will deal with them. There. That should be all of them. The Phoebe, did you leave anything else out of your adventure? Say a crate of drachmas. You wound me, Magi. I am in search of knowledge. And a drachma or two, but never in theft. It looks like there are no others coming, Te Phoebe. Return to your mother and your studies. Come and see me any time in Alexandria, Magi. I will be a great philosopher. Just you wait. I look forward to it, Te Phoebe. I need someone for one quick job. It's a good coin. No, not you. You you keep going. Do not stop here. You, that insignia. You are a man of honor. There are so few remaining. I am a Magi. I solve problems. Good. I have one. A most precious treasure which must be delivered today. You will be well compensated for your work. Here are some drachmas to start. This city is much more expensive than I'm used to. Good! It is settled. Follow me. The thing I ask you to do is of the utmost importance. Of course it is. Being a merchant is no simple matter, sir. I assure you, moving tiger skins or even statues is not easy work. Ah, these workers never when you tell them to be. As I was saying, you must be quick. Oh! And do not stray from your task, at all. I will know if you have. This is all I have left since the flood. Seems you care a lot for your... cargo. I swear on her mother's grave she was sent from the gods to make Alexandria better. She? I have your bodyguard, Kara. Do not let this be a repeat of the last time, daughter. Wait, oh, this hardly seems to be what you asked. Magi, I will pour drachmas down your throat as long as she is safe. Kara, remember the reception tonight. You will be ready. Of course, Father. I would not miss it. I am so happy you have come to assist me, sir. We will get you home fast. Do not worry. Oh, of course. Thank you, my bull. You look just like Heracles. Perhaps I'll call you my Heracles. Finally. Change of plans, Heracles. Who? Ah, no matter. Child, it's time to return you home. I will not go. Have you met the priests here? Dull. Now, I must go to the central market. I heard of new Persian linens. I need them. Or what? I will scream, which will call the soldiers. Then, well, even if you survive, father will be quite angry. Anubis, take this city. Are you Sekhmet in disguise? Sent to test me. What was that? Nothing. Good. First, we must get my horse. She's been treated absolutely terribly without me around. You'd think someone would clean this water. Ugh. I simply adore this part of the city. So rustic. You can smell it in the air. They live a truly simple life here. Pegasus simply can't wait to be reunited with me. Of course, you named your horse Pegasus. Cheer up, bodyguard. Young miss, it's so nice to see you again. As you asked, she has been given new shoes. There now, was that so difficult? Now out of my pay. The deal was only to get you home. 
not to pay for your horse. I'm sure my father would not be pleased with you discussing this in front of him, horseman. Of course. Uh, I'll discuss it with your father. Oh, Pegasus. I know you missed me. Yes, you did, you beautiful creature. If only you had wings. Time to go, bodyguard. Oh. Oh. That is it. I am taking you home, Princess Kara. Oh, all you big broody types are the same. Never let me have any fun. Oh. I should just leave you here. You're duty bound to deliver me, are you not? Who would know if I left? Your conscience would, of course. Look there, bodyguard. Th that is where I had my first discussion with the soldier. I am sure he was very grateful. We must stop at the market for more linens. I will take you to your house as your father bade, and nowhere else. Now lead on. You know, you are absolutely destroying my chances at getting the perfect linens. There are different kinds of linen? You are much more serious than my usual bodyguards. You could move faster, bodyguard. I have a name! Bayek. Ah, you do know my name. I remember all their names, you know. Whose names? The bodyguards. I send gifts to their families when I can. Gara, Gara. Yes? If we go find your linens, would you be happy? Really? Of course! Thank you, Bayek. You have an interesting stare. Thank you. We are close. Finally. <laughs> Aha! Finally! These linens show some promise. Ah, oh, it's so heavy. Would you help me? Bayek! Pegasus! They stole my horse! Stay here. Do not leave. Oh, there, guy. Hey, time to get you home. The troublesome oh. mistress will have missed you. Pegasus, huh? I like it. It suits a horse. I would like your spirit. <laughs> oh. Over here, Bayek. Oh. Papa, since Pegasus was limping, Bayek went to deal with her shoe. It was only gone a moment. Ah. I heard some commotion, but according to my little princess, you're the hero of the day. Can he always be my bodyguard? Please, father? How much does it cost to hire a Medjai permanently? I am here only a short while. Alas. Then allow me to grant you a hero's pay for a hero's service. You've returned to me. Are you ready to be my personal Magi? Uh, well, uh, no. I, I continue. You, you see... Uh... <laughs> you are so gullible, Bayek. I'm only happy to see you still in one piece. Best bodyguard in this city. <laughs> 